Big news from Auburn. RM Auctions out of Canada has bought Cruise International Auction Park. Good afternoon. Glad you're joining us. I'm Tara Brantley. And I'm Pat Hoffman. As we mentioned, it has been talked about for some time, but today it became official. The Cruise Auction Park does in fact have a new owner this afternoon. That deal was announced late this morning. News Channel 15's Janice Allen joins us live from Auburn with what this means for the future of the company and the Labor Day auction. Janice? Well, Pat, it is definitely official. Dean Cruz announced that he has sold the auction park here in Auburn to Canadian company RM Auctions. And as part of that deal, the Cruz name that you see behind me and all the signage that says Cruz will be coming down. This big announcement took place at the Auburn Court Duesenberg Museum just a few moments ago. We do have video of that event to show you. Now, as part of this deal, RM Auctions will buy the auction park and operate it under the name of Auctions America by RM. RM t is touted as the world's largest car collector auction house and it plans to put a lot of money into this site for upgrades to the look and the maintenance of it. And as I mentioned, all the cruise signage will come down as part of that deal. The company plans to host the first event here, being the first, uh, their first annual Labor Day auction, I should say. Now, what brought us up to this point, of course, last month, Dean Cruz was stripped of his auctioneer and auction house licenses. It has been a very rocky year for him. He still has about 62 unpaid sellers, sellers that he says he does still plan to pay back. Take a listen to what Dean Cruz and the president of RM Auctions had to say about this deal. During this process uh, of nine or ten months, it was sort of like giving birth to a baby. I, I was in the process of negotiating, which was interesting, and, and hopefully that would be good. And then there was the birth when we finally did it, which was very painful for me in, a, in, in some ways. And then when I saw the new baby, when I saw the deal and it was done, I realized this was the right thing. We're very committed to doing this, and, it, and, and we're going to be very successful at it. No questions in my mind. Now, both sides aren't saying anything about the price that this property went for. They're only saying they are looking forward to this Labor Day auction, of course, just about 60 days away here, and lots of work needed to get that event up and going. And uh, the company, uh, the president of Armed Auction, says that he hopes to make that event bigger and better. We will have much more on this news on our website, Wayne.com, and also at 5 and 6 here on News Channel 15. But for now, reporting live in Auburn, I'm Janice Allen, News Channel 15.